back to Technophobics Anonymous. This is Randy Velker. Uh, today I'll be talking a little bit about security uh, on the internet as you're going to be going out there. There are some things that you need to be aware of before you get too far into uh, surfing and heading out there. You want to surf safely. Uh, the first thing um, that we need to talk about is uh, a you want to make sure that your software your computer software, whether it's Windows XP or uh, Windows Vista, is um, up to date. Right? Because what happens is uh, there are people out there that write code that can break in to uh, Windows XP and take advantage of it, or Windows Vista. And so what you want to do is you want to, as soon as that happens, um, Microsoft will go ahead and fix that. All right, they'll, they'll make a few changes, a few tweaks, and fix that security problem. And then they'll uh, post that on their website as a fix or an update. So what you need to do is you need to get your computer uh, to automatically go to the Windows site and check and see if there's any updates. They're called security updates. All right, uh, let's go ahead and, and show you how that, that works. All right, what you do is you go to the uh, start menu, you're going to go to settings. Uh, you're going you're to find the control panel. Go ahead and open up your control panel. In, now this is Windows XP, uh, uh, but Vista is going to be very similar. You're going to go to the security center. All right, go ahead and do that. Now in the security center, there's a couple things, um, and it talks about how to get the latest updates from Windows. Basically, you can click on that, you can click on this information, but what you want to do is you want to look over here at the security essentials. Right? You want to make sure that you have a firewall and that that firewall is turned on. Right? And what this does is this, this will um, reject other people out on the internet from coming into your computer. Right? If they come into your computer, it'll say, wait a second, you've got someone trying to, you got someone trying to break in. All right, so basically what this is doing is this is putting a fence up around your property. All right, and you have an automatic gatekeeper there. And so anytime somebody tries to come into your computer, that gatekeeper is going to say, uh, it'll stop the intruder and say, hey, are you really sure you want to let this person in? This guy's trying to get in. All right, so basically you want to have a firewall turned on at all times. And it's right here on the computer. You want to make sure that it says on. Right. You can click it so that it's off or on absolutely. When you're, if you're surfing the internet, make sure that the firewall is turned on. The other thing you want to do is make sure that automatic updates are turned on as well. All right. You just click on this button right here where it says on. All right. What it'll do is right then it'll go over to the Microsoft uh, site and it'll, it'll look, read and see um, the latest updates that you have on your computer and it'll match it up if there's any more current updates that Microsoft has to make your computer safer, it'll download those, and uh, from then on, it'll automatically say, you know, at, at midnight every night or whenever, whenever it'll, it does that, or every week or so, it'll automatically go over there and check for any updates and download them. So, so you will be protected uh, as, as well as you can be um, with these automatic updates from Microsoft. Uh, they also have a virus protection. Go ahead and turn that on as well. Uh, we'll be talking a little bit more about virus, and you're going to want more protection than, um, than these guys are offering right here. Uh, but this is the bare minimum that you need to do to make sure that you're uh, safely surfing the Internet. Um, all right, we'll, we'll see you next time as we talk a little bit more about uh, virus protection. Thanks.